Hello guys and welcome back to our channel Rescue Digital Media. Today in this video, I am going to show you how to fix destination folder access denied error with best ways. But before we get started, like, subscribe and ring the bell icon to get notified when our new video lands. Now, let's move on to fix destination folder access denied error with 4 best fixes. Solution 1. Check your system's permission. First, check if your account has proper access to all files, folders, and storage drives you're trying to access in your system. To do so, you have to Locate the file or folder you want to access Right-click on it, and open its properties Next, Security Then Edit Now, choose your username from the list and select full control under the allow option given beside permissions for user. Finally, click apply. OK. Solution 2, perform CHKDSK to repair the disk. You can use CHKDSK to solve the destination folder access denied error. For this, press Windows plus R keys to open the execution window. Then type CMD. And select run as system administrator. In the command prompt window, type chkdskc, slash f slash r and hit enter. Note that the c in the command can be replaced with an unreachable volume letter. Don't worry if you get a message that chkdsk cannot be executed. Just press the Y key and the disk will be checked the next time you start your computer and repaired if any disk errors are found. Solution 3. Take ownership of the directory. The folder access denied error might appear if you don't have access to certain files or directories. You can try fixing it by taking ownership of the directory. For this, you have to Locate the folder slash file with which you're having the issue, right-click on it, and open properties. Next, follow security. Then advanced. Search for owner at the top. And then click change. On doing so, the select user slash groups window will appear. On this window, type administrators or your username. Next, click check names. OK. Finally, select replace owner on subcontainers and objects. Then apply OK. Once done, close the window and check if the error is resolved. Solution 4. Perform a clean boot. The next solution is to performing a clean boot. A clean boot can start the system by using a minimal set of drivers and startup programs to exclude any third-party applications and services from interfering. To perform a clean boot, you have to Use Windows plus R keys to open the execution window. Type sconfig and press enter. Services tab at the top of the system settings window. Check the Hide All Microsoft Services checkbox in the lower left corner, and then click the Disable All button. Then switch to the Startup tab, and click the Enable Task Manager button. In the list of Startup tabs, select each Startup item in turn, click the Disable button in turn, and then turn off Task Manager. Go back to the Startup tab of System Settings, and click the OK button. So. This is all about fixing destination folder access denied you need to confirm this operation error. If you found this video useful, then give it a like, share it with other users and also don't forget to subscribe to our channel to watch more useful videos. Thanks for watching.